Hello students, how are you all? I hope you are happy and healthy. Children, as you all know, we are revising letter writing. Today we are going to continue the same format, form a letter. Today we will write more letters. So children, let's start. Children, as you all know, these form a letter we are supposed to write to higher authority. So children, today we are going to write one letter which we will write to district magistrate. So children, let's start. I'll first I'll write question on that uh, this uh, board, and after that we will solve this. So children, let's write. You write a letter. Write a letter. Write a letter of complaint. Of complaint of complaint to the additional director to the additional 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 district magistrate district magistrate. Magistrate, it means civil supply, civil supply, civil supply of your district, of your district, of your district regarding, regarding scarcity. scarcity of sugar of sugar of sugar and kerosene and kerosene kerosene at the fair at the fair Price shop. Price shop. So children here you can see this is the question and you just write it down that you are writing a letter a complaint to the additional district magistrate. Okay. Civil supply of your district regarding scarcity of sugar and kerosene at the fair price shop. So children this is your complaint. And here we are going to write the same topic in the letter. How to write? Let's see. So children, let's start. So children, first of all, we will write our address, whatever our address is there. Okay, today is first February. So we will write first February two thousand twenty one. Okay, children. Now I think it is visible. And after that, what we are going to write? We are going to write the address of address of the additional additional district magistrate additional district additional district magistrate Magistrate Civil Supply Civil Supply Varanasi. Okay, now here we have done sender's address, 
date and after that receiver's address. So children, now subject. Now after this, what is the topic? Next that is subject children. So security of sugar, scarcity or sorry, scarcity of sugar and and kerosene kerosene at the fair price at the fair price shop so children, this is uh, your subject, on which subject you are writing that you have done. Now children, we are moving to the letter. So children, we are going to write sir or you can write dear sir, dear sir, I would like, I would like to bring to your to bring to your kind notice kind notice that the working that the working of the fair price shop working of the fair price shop price shop of our locality of our locality is very is very unsatisfactory because here you are showing or you are complaining that the locality supply is very unsatisfactory so here mostly mostly the essential articles the essential articles like sugar like sugar and kerosene and kerosene are out of stock out of stock the needy customers the needy customers suffer a lot suffer a lot the person in charge the person in charge of the shop of the shop indulges indulges in dishonest respect in dishonest practice so you are complaining about the dishonest uh, indulges indulges in dishonest practice that you are complaining 
Now, after children, we will write the residence of the locality. Residence of the locality of the locality have lodge have lodged several complaint several complaint now here children you are writing to the high authority so you just taking care of your language which type of the language you have you are using because total formal language you will use over here so against him but they have provided but they have provided no redress no redress children now we are moving to the next line you are you are therefore requested to take to take personal personal interest personal interest in the matter in the matter because it is i think after that i'll erase few lines are left so i will write here in the matter after in the matter and take and take effective and take effective steps take uh, steps to remove to remove the difficulties the difficulties caused by the caused by the caused by the scarcity scarcity of sugar and kerosene and kerosene at the fair at the fair price shop children so here you have completed you have written all the matters all the complaints whatever the things is going on in your locality you have mentioned over here in everything you have mentioned over here because this is really really uh, the situation will become dangerous after few days that is why you are complaining so here children now we are moving to the subscription part so children because of this i am removing so here you are writing thanking you thanking you and after that your sincerely 
sincerely whatever your name you will write and the letter is completed now. So children write it down, whole letter is there and uh, subject I have removed so you can mention, take a screenshot. Now we are moving to the next letter. Now children, the, our next letter is to the, we are going to write to the police commissioner about the loudspeaker that uh, it is re really, really disturbing in our examination days. So that is why you are complaining. You are requesting to remove loudspeakers. So now we will write question first and after that we will write letter. Okay children? So as you all know the format of the letter. So children first of all we will write our address. Whatever your address you can write down. Okay. Now here date. And now we will write the address or you can say we are writing to the police commissioner that we will do here. So first of all we will write question. So write children question write a letter to the police commissioner. Write a letter to the police commissioner commissioner requesting him requesting him to restrict to restrict the use of the use of loudspeaker loudspeakers during examination days So children as you all know this is very common problem that we are facing during our examination. So that is why we are writing this letter. So children write it down first question and after that we will write letter. So children first of all write it down. Okay children now as we have written our address and date now we are going to start our letter. So I hope you have completed this question. Now we are moving to answer or we are going to write letter. So children let us start. The police commissioner Commissioner Lucknow Subject Subject you are writing over here children So what is the subject? Subject Restriction on loudspeaker Restriction on loud speakers because our exam time if any disturbance is there so it is very very 
unavoidable thing. So that is why your complaint is very uh, formal and uh, you are writing this complaint in this way you can write this complaint. I would like to sorry first you will start respected respected sir or you can write dear sir I would like to bring bring to your kind notice. Now here children I have written respected you can write dear sir. So you can start as a subscription dear sir. So notice that that the class 10th and 12th examination mination of CBS E or you can write any board of our school you can write of our school are at hand are at hand are at hand but the but the continuous continuous noise of loudspeaker noise of noise of loudspeaker loudspeakers does not allow does not allow does not allow us students students to study peacefully to study peacefully now here children you can write you about your examination so here I have mentioned 10th and 12th because this is the board examination that is why I have mentioned over here and this is very common problem while preparing their uh, for their examination this problem is always coming in their studies time so that is why so I am writing peacefully the disturbance The disturbance of loudspeaker loudspeakers usually continuous usually continuous usually continuous till midnight till Continues you can write. Continues till midnight. It's really major problem. And sometimes and sometimes even the whole night. Even the whole night. even after the restriction by the government but the people are not 
following these rules that after 10 o'clock nobody will make their sound louder. So this is the restriction by the government in cantonment area because we are living in the cantonment area. So you can see after 10 o'clock nobody will raise their voices or the loudspeaker is prohibited. So this restriction or you can say what are the rules are made for the benefit of the people. The people those who are living in this country are not following the rule. So that is why the problem is coming. So whole night it has become it has become it has become therefore therefore difficult to difficult to concentrate concentrate on studies yes children because distraction is always there noise are always there so it is very difficult for the students to concentrate on the studies so whenever you are preparing for exam you need silence because in silence you can learn properly so these are the uh, points that you have mentioned in this letters this is very very appropriate for you because these problems are always coming in our study period so because this is the examination time that is why you are so worried about your study that is why you are writing this letter now we are moving ahead in this uh, letter so we student we students shall be because you are complaining collectively that is why you have to mention we students shall be obliged obliged if you if you kindly if you kindly restrict restrict the use of the use of loud speakers use of loud speakers during during the examination days during the examination days so children this is necessary for us that is why we are writing this letter thanking you very much thanking you you can write like this and here you will write your sincerely whatever your name is there you can write so children this is how we have completed our this letter so children I have written in this you can see I would like to bring to your kind notice that the class 10th and 12th examinations of our school are at hand but the continuous noise of loudspeaker does not allow us students to study peacefully the disturbance of loudspeakers usually continues till midnight and sometimes even the whole night. It has become therefore difficult to concentrate to studies. We students shall be obliged if you kindly restrict the use of loudspeaker during the examination. So children we have completed this letter. From this letter we can understand how to write a formal letter to high authority. So children because we are talking about formal letter so that is why it is uh, whatever we have learned 
that is only and only the format and after that the matter how we are going into the matter and how to uh, put our points in front of the any authority. So that we have learned today that whatever the problems we are facing we should mention in that because here you can see that you have mentioned till night even the whole night the loudspeaker are working and nobody bother about the children's study. So that is why this is very very you can say major problem of our society that they are not bother about any other's problem. They are just uh, enjoying but they are not thinking about the public problem. So this is how you have written this letter in a very proper way, in a very concise way. You have mentioned all things, all problems in the letter. So children, whenever you are writing letter, this is my suggestion that you will start with your address, then date, then the address of police commissioner, whatever you have written. Now restriction on loudspeaker, this is your subject, respected sir. Now here you have written very beautifully about your problem and you are requesting to the police commissioner to restrict these type of the loudspeaker because it's disturbing the scholars of 10th and 12th. So here you can change, you can write 6 or 7 students. Uh, so this way you can write letter. So children, this is your letter, write it down, take a screenshot. Before going to conclude, I would like to tell you about the format of formal letter. First of, first of all, so children, uh, first of all heading, as we have discussed, heading and after that subject, after that salutation, body, subscription and signature. So these are the part of formal letter. This way you can write a formal letter. So children, you just focus on this and we will be continue the same to topic tomorrow also. So we will discuss more letters how to write to high authority that we will discuss tomorrow. So children, till then, bye-bye and take care.